clockwise function. And many more. Okay guys, welcome to the piecewise function and how do we solve for the piecewise function? We know that f of x is always equal to y. Like no. So the first equation is x squared, where x greater than 1. So think of the number that x greater than 1. So these are the 2, 3, 4, up to million and so on. So what are the numbers? So, x less than equal to negative 1, and our equation is x plus 1. So, what are the numbers less than 1? These are the negative 2, negative 3, negative 4, and so on. So, first, let's try to identify that the given is letter A for 4. So, it means to say, we need to substitute that x is greater than 1 because x greater than 1 are 2, 3, 4. So let's substitute y. Okay, let's 
let's go for letter C, which is the value of positive E. And then how do we solve for this one? In order to identify the piecewise function, positive 3 belongs to x squared. Why? Because x greater than 1 are the numbers 2, 3, 4. So there are these are the 3, or this is the 3. So it is qualified for letter C. So how do we solve for this one? Again, y, x squared, y, 3 squared is equals to 9. So y is equals to 9, or f of x is equals to 9. So this is what you call the piecewise function. Take note now, this is 9. So, y is equals to 9. Okay, let's proceed for another set of example of piecewise function. And our given, f of x, x squared minus 2, x less than or equal to the negative 2. And what are the numbers that less than or equal to 2? Automatically, it's negative 2. Greater than 5. What are the numbers greater than 5? So 6, 7, 8, and so on. And then, x is equals to 5. Automatically, 5 will be. So, the first is negative 3. Where do we find negative 3? In order to understand the piecewise function. So, let, uh, let's proceed for the x squared minus 2 because x less than or equal to the negative 2, so there is a negative 3. So automatically, f of x, x squared minus 2, which is the negative 3, minus 2, this is 9, minus 2, and then f of x, is equal to 7, or y, to 6 and then after that let's try to solve x to the 1 because 2x plus 1 which is x greater than 5 are the numbers 6, 7, 8, 9 and so on so it means to say you will choose x greater than 5 so let's try to substitute y equals to 13. So, the answer for letter B is equals to 13. Which is equivalent to 5 automatically. So, X is equals to 5. Let's substitute Y. X minus 5. So, 0 minus, or sorry, 5 minus 5. And then Y is equals to 0 or F of X is equals to zero so this will be the final answer for okay, let's proceed to the piecewise function and how do we do that so y for f of x to x minus 3 which is equivalent to x is equal to 5 so what will you do f of x equivalent to x is equals to 3 again y x minus 5 
and then y 3 minus 5 and then y is equal to negative 2 so where do we put negative 2 